Hello, and in this video we're going to take a look at how we can split solid objects that may have slightly complex forms, such as curved edges. I'm Greg benson Shadow from Address Professional Services. Here we have uh, two semicircular solids uh, that have been joined together, so that it's just one object. Uh, we're going to split these so they become two. First of all, we go to our 3D modeling working space, wait for the icons to load up. Now, to do this, we want to use this edge of this element here to cut the surface. So we need to actually generate a surface along that as a separate item. And we're going to use this end shape here as a profile for generating that cutting edge. So first things first, we need to change the way our working space is actually uh, orientated. At the moment, everything is in standard uh, plan view. We can see on the view cube this says front and you've got top up here. So from the in canvas uh, view controls, and it's important that we do them here, um, we can pick on the front view. Just swing this back round. And now if you look in the view cube, we can see that AutoCAD thinks that this is the top view on this face here. The next tool we're going to use is the Extract Edges uh, command, which you'll find on here. We then simply click on the solid object there, and that completes it. Now, if we use a selective window like so, you can see that an edge has been created, and we can use that to uh, extrude a shape through. So we just push a shape through to the end. Now, we've got a cutting surface that we can use, so come up to the slice tool. We're going to select the object that we want to slice. And then looking down in the command line, we're going to pick on the surface option. Or you can type S and hit return. And then we pick this surface, just like so. Hit return. And now this is a completely separate object. As simple as that. And then it's simply a case of deleting the construction geometry uh, that we first created as a cutting edge. And there we have it how to cut a semi complex solid. I hope you found that useful. Bye for now.